We've never seen a song. We went for a cute song. They should let us know when they're Yeah, that one never gave us a warning. <laughs> All right, number nine, they call it Car in a Bag. This is Walk Car. A okay. company called Coco Motors in Tokyo has made it. It's about the size of a laptop. A Japanese engineer came up with the idea after he wondered what if we could just carry our transportation in our bags? It's battery charged and go up to six miles an hour for up to seven miles. Wow. And you just stand on it. Yeah. Boy. What could go wrong? Notice everyone is young and athletic. Yeah, well, no helmet. <laughs> right. there's yeah. No, there's no 48 year old accountants taking right. those doors. Thank you. Yeah. I mean, these are all like, you know. Yeah, Rory, 20 year old. Six miles per hour, too. Nersha, look at that. I mean, give it a try. Number eight. Feeling like a challenge, how about a trip to Wendenstock, Switzerland for a week of mountain climbing in the Swiss Alps? Ooh. Considered one of the most challenging climbs in the world, the routes are almost always covered in wet grass and warmer months, ice and snow in the winter. It is so steep, only the most experienced climbers have attempted it, and they say even then they've only tried it after they've run out of other things to climb. Wow. Look at this. Oh, man. Oh, God. Oh. Nope. No. Uh, all right, number seven. Finally, for the first time in 75 years, Dr. Seuss's home is for sale. Oh. Private hillside compound in La Jolla, California. You'll have one of a kind ocean views on one side. You'll have mountain views on the other. There's also a giant pool. Ooh, oh, gosh, plus secret that. doors hidden behind bookshelves since, well, it's Dr. Seuss's house. Sure. And whimsical little surprises should be expected. Yeah. The compound is currently owned by the University of California, San Diego. Uh, Seuss's late wife gifted it to the university in 2019. You can buy all of it for 19 million. Oh. Or you could break it up and buy one of four main sites for a few mm. million dollars a piece, but to me, that just defeats the whole purpose. Yeah. Well, I mean, gee, you, really you know, I wonder to, yeah. if his, you know, when she left it to the university, if she said, you know, this is for the university, yeah. I bet yeah. she could have, I mean. You use it. You're gonna sold it herself. Yeah, that's yeah. weird. I'm guessing she's doing pretty well, though, yeah. that it's, Probably you so. know. And it looked like a fixer-upper, let's be yeah. honest. She wants yeah. a pool from the 1970s yeah. for $19 million. <laughs> All right, number six, uh, I have to give some props to my guy Yeezy for how oh, yeah. he's displaying his new clothes line, clothing line at The Gap. Kanye's clothes are being displayed in these heaping trash bags that just sit there on the, the Gap floor. He's a genius. Oh, he sure is. These picks are from the store in New York's Times Square, and they've been shared a bunch. Uh, someone working there says it's done at Kanye's request, which is brilliant. Another way to save a little money. And yeah. I also read there's something ironic about fishing a $240 sweatshirt out of a... Yeah, of a trash yeah you have to dig trash through bag. it, yeah. You find your size. Yeah, not easy. Okay. Find it. All right, number five, have you seen the Gucci Kids bag collection this spring? Oh. For this season? Excuse me, it's pretty impressive. But you're not a Kardashian. Bill Gates isn't your dad, so you're probably not going to get one of these bags no, for your kids. Not. Still, they're getting lots of attention from influencers right now, and they are snatching them up. These are for kids? Yeah. They're half the price of a regular Gucci hand. Oh, oh, so it's a bargain. It. Yeah. So they can post all sorts of pics on the gram, mm -hmm. call themselves whimsical. Oh, yeah. I mean, even though they're half the price of a regular Gucci bag, they're still, what? Yeah. Expensive. Grand, yeah. yeah. Huh. There you go. If you see a kid on uh, Instagram carrying one of those bags from your kid's class, you tell your kid the next day to walk up to that kid, yeah. and give him a giant wedgie. Yeah. <laughs> oh, no. Yeah. Give him a giant wedgie. <laughs> and a swirly. Yeah. <laughs> and give him the chance. Yep. <laughs> and, and go from there. Yep, I agree. For number four. So, what do you think is happening here? Take a look here. This guy is showing off an ancient way of preserving Boy. food. That uh, disc shaped thing is very grainy dough that's baked to be super hard, and inside, Wait and see what's inside. Exciting. Grapes. What? They've been kept what? fresh for six months. No. Get out of here, Dan. 
Well, let me tell you how it works All here. Right, uh, the grapes do. go bad if they are out in the open and have uh, access to oxygenated air, but if you put the grapes inside a hard dough and seal it tight, that limits the air that can be exposed to the grape there, though, so All the right. grapes are kept in... Um, uh, well, by that theory, wouldn't they stay fresh for six months in like a Tupperware container or something? Right. Yeah. yeah, but this yeah. is an eight. This is we're talking about what they did in ancient times here. This I, is but see, my point is, I don't think they stay fresh in Tupperware that long. I mean, that they, so there must be something about the dough oh. or something, right? So right. maybe, right? That's unbelievable. Yeah. yeah, yeah, no air can get in there. That's cool. fun. That's yeah. just fun to ask questions that we can <laughs> yeah. Yeah. leave people wondering. That's yeah. the goal of get reporting the think. news. Get <laughs> other people to go find the information yeah. on their own. Yeah. That's what uh, we're all about. Yeah. Uh, number three, here's a little Thursday morning inspiration for you. Liam Hemsworth working out on the deck of a naval ship. What's up, everyone? Hope you're doing well. One of the greatest locations I've ever had the pleasure of training in. I've written a bunch of workouts, That's some body awesome. weight, some with equipment, some with combination. Check them out, follow along. I'll drop one each week for the next few months. Enjoy. Well, maybe not. They are brothers. That's a good looking workout he's got going on there. Oh. Oh. That's good for your lower back, I'd imagine. When that's it. Yeah. We don't get to see the rest. Oh, boy, that's He's it. in good shape. That's yeah. The point. Uh, what more were you looking for? Like uh, squat <laughs> maybe thrust? Maybe a burpee. Maybe <laughs> he's yeah. going to do a jumping jack. Yeah. You know, jumping yeah. jacks are a very underrated yeah. exercise. Yeah. 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 All right. Hmm. Ball number two. All right, number two. Uh, you probably can't guess what these guys are standing next to. That there is a chain that was used... Uh, for one of the anchors for the Titanic. Jeez. Incredible amount of work went into making just the anchor. It required 16 tons of steel. 3,000 men in a small English town took two years to make it. Uh, this white one in the photo is just a replica in the English town of Netherton because, of course, I don't know if you guys heard of the actual Titanic sank. Oh, it sunk. Uh, uh, it did. Way to yeah. spoil the movie, Sorry. Paul. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I heard it at a barn burger of an end, but um, yeah, yeah. Buddy. there you go. Look at that. Big anchor, though. Wow. Yep. All right, number one from Australia. That's all they're telling me. Yep. Check this out. Oh, oh well, that's all you need to. So, Whee! Oh, the old leaf frog. This is great. This oh, is God. outstanding. This is really good. Yeah. This, this is our new morning show yeah. promo. I think we could get the whole team together and, and recreate this. Mm. <laughs> you kidding? Whee! That's I just want to see. Uh, I don't think you're getting that high, to be honest with you. <laughs> oh, Larry loves to do that jazz yeah. hand yeah, step. Does. <laughs> and you could wear his velour one piece. Yeah. Great. Along with his smoking jacket. Wow. wow. Do we know anything more about it? Is this a local news just, team? No, I don't think it just any said from Australia. from Australia. That's wow, not really they good. know how to party. Yeah. yeah, they do. Boy, that brought a lot of joy to a lot of it people. Did. Wow. Just here alone. Yeah. Well, let's just mm. keep that on file if we need to yeah. pep up our mood. At some point, mood. the show starts getting dark. We yep. just roll that. Cue that yeah. up again. All right, that's 9 at 9.